I wanted to take a quick video so that I can very accurately demonstrate what's going on with this uh, Tissot T-Touch. Um, everything's in working order except for the compass and I've uh, followed the directions on calibrating the compass. You can't really screw that up too bad. <laughs> um, I'm sure Tissot is going to ask for this back but they're going to want to know what's wrong with it. So I'm going to demonstrate for you. I'm actually facing north right now. Directly north and I can put this into the compass mode. And you can see that it's not pointing north. It should be straight up at the 12 o'clock position. Now let me show you what happens when I start turning just very gradually. See how wild that was? I've actually only turned about 15 degrees to the right and it's now pointing an entirely different direction. Same thing back to the left. I mean, you know, I'll give you more reference here because you have to hold it flat. So, this is flat. Oh, I have to put it back in compass mode. It expires after a few seconds. All right, so we're back in compass mode. Again, this, should, this is due north, should be north. If I start turning, that needle just swings like bananas. And I'm gonna go ahead and do a full 360 so you can see See right there, it just swung all the way back around like it had no idea, like past a certain point, what to do. So here's from right here. And again, I'm holding it perfectly flat like you should. I've owned these watches for oh, about eight, eight years or so and I know how they're supposed to behave. This is definitely not right.